everybody and welcome back to the channel in today's video you guys i just have two different hauls i wanted to show you guys i did get some stuff from amazon for my upcoming trip to cabo and i also did a walmart haul so i just let me just show you really quick what i got from amazon i did end up getting this really cool like bag that you can put all kinds of stuff in for the trip. It's huge inside. It does have some zippered components in there. It has one in the front as well with a really long arm strap on it. And I just thought the design, I mean, it's a decent size bag. I love the design because I thought it was like perfect for Mexico because I wanted something to carry around with me besides a purse or a beach bag. So this could probably double as both because I mean, it is really big. It has it's really comfy you could probably wear it cross body so i was really excited about that i love this bag i also did get i also did get this cool hat this fun beach hat let's see here oh i got a i got a clippy in back here hold on let's take my hair down real quick i did get this hat i think it's super cute it will be super cute for in Cabo to keep the sun out my face. Your girl, look, you know, I do look pretty damn decent in hats, I must say. I really like this hat, too. So I think it, you, if you watch my upcoming vlogs while I'm in Cabo, I will have this hat on. I will. I promise I will. <laughs> so, yes, I do like this hat. It's super cute. They have a lot of different varieties, like different colors, all kinds of different ones. So it... um. It, it's, it seems like it can fold up pretty well, too, without losing its shape. So that was important to me, too. But, um, yeah, it, it's they had a lot of different colors in these hats, like red, black. They had all kinds of different ones with different coloring bands around it. So I thought that was pretty cool. But, yeah, I really do like this hat, and I'm going to be wearing that a lot while I'm in Cabo. Let me put my hair up. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I had to put my hair back up, y'all. It drives me crazy sometimes when I wear it down. Sometimes I don't mind it, but today it's driving me a little nuts. Okay. From Walmart, you guys, I did pick up four items from Walmart, which I've had one of them in the past, but these other ones I have not. So I wanted to get them. I did get this in the past, the Strawberry Tree Hut Scrub. I love this one. I've had all kinds of different strawberry scrubs. I've had them from Bath and Body Works, from the original strawberry that they came out with in 2020 during the height of COVID. I've had Pink's Strawberry Body Scrub, which was hideous. I hated that. Bath and Body Works was good. The strawberry from Tree Hut is very good. I love Tree Hut Scrubs. They're phenomenal. They're really, really good. They just have such a great consistency to them. They're just really, really good. So, yes, I did get one in Strawberry, which I've had this before. The other one that I saw, it's not a new release, but it's new to me because I have not seen it in a Walmart. Now, maybe y'all have where you're at, but me personally, I have not seen it in a Walmart by me. So, when I saw this, like a crow, I'm like, ooh, what is that, right? Um... Pineapple. The pineapple one. Now, yes, these are not fall winter scents. However, I will tuck this beauty away and I will use her next spring and summer because tree hut scrubs are banging. And pineapple, this one, look at that. It's got like, you can't really see because my camera has like brown flecks in it that looks super. I don't know what that's supposed to be, but it smells amazing. It just smells like fresh pineapples. And it smells so good. So I really cannot wait to use this in the shower. I might use this at least once in there to test it out because it just smells so freaking good. I already know what I'm going to be pairing this with next year. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yes, I did get pineapple. The other two things I got, y'all. Now, this is not necessarily new either, but I, again, have never been able to get my sniffer on this, and I wanted to try it out. And that is Bodycology's Dark Cherry Orchid. I've heard a lot of YouTubers talk about this one, and I wanted to try it out myself. It says the scent notes are a flirty blend of dark cherry orchid and luscious empress peach, right? So, to me, you guys, I swear to God, this, to me, smells like a combination of champagne toast and black cherry Merlot at Bath & Body Works. 
Yeah, it's like champagne toast and black cherry Merlot mixed together. It definitely is, is bright. It's not like deep and dark. It's bright. It's bubbly. I do really like this. Again, you know, we all know about ecology. They don't last a long time. This is one you're going to have to reapply like crazy. But for the money, it's worth it. I think, what are they, like $4 or something like that? I can't even remember what it was. But yeah, dark cherry orchid and lustrous empress peach. Yeah. This does, I do like this. I do like this. So I already know what I'll probably be pairing this with. Even, this would probably go really, really well with champagne toast or black cherry mellow. No joke. So yes. And then I got the new one. I got the new one, which is chilled bubbly. Body Ecology's chilled bubbly. It says, celebrate the moment with a spritz of chilled bubbly and its blended notes of festive fruits, sparkling champagne, golden vanilla, and sugared woods. Now, when I hear that, I tend to think it's going to be one thing, right? I think it's going to smell like one thing. Although, just looking at the packaging, I immediately thought champagne toast from Bath & Body Works. Immediately thought it. Now, so I'm here to tell you, This is not champagne toast. It is different. It is different. Does it have a very similar DNA? Yes. But this is different, you guys. Absolutely, it is different. It has more... It's like champagne toast if they mixed a little bit of Sunrise Woods with it and vanilla. I do like it. I really do like it because it is different. It is not, like I said, it is not champagne toast. I do like this. So let's just spray a little bit. Oh, uh huh, uh huh. I do like this. Yes. Chilled bubbly. For the cost of it, absolutely worth it. Again, they're super affordable, super cheap. I haven't seen this one sold out. I've seen it pretty much at every Walmart in my area, which I was kind of surprised. But yeah, chilled bubbly for the win. It says festive fruits and sparkling champagne on the front. So, but it is similar to champagne toast, but it's it's not the same. It's not the same, at least not to my sniffer. So, but anyway, you guys, that is everything for my little haul that I got from Amazon. I got from Walmart. I just wanted to share it with you guys really quick. I know it's nothing big and huge, but when I get new stuff, I love showing you guys and telling you guys about it. Like, especially if I really like it. Um, if I get, if I sniff it and I don't like it, I want you guys to know, cause I don't want you guys to waste your money on this stuff. You know what I mean? So, but anyway, that is everything I have for this video. You guys, please hit that like button down below, comment, subscribe, subscribe. We're almost to 1k and I do have a 1k video that we are going to be doing for a 1k giveaway once we hit that milestone. So stay tuned for that. So make sure you ding the bell, you guys. So you are alerted when I upload that you're not going to want to miss this giveaway I'm going to do. So anyway, you guys, that is all I have for today, and I will catch you in the next one. All right, you guys, bye-bye.